Greetings from the Gozueta Business School. My name is Allison Jacobs, and I am the Associate Director in our Graduate Admissions Department. I am very excited to spend the next few minutes with you to tell you about our newly launched MBA MSBA program. The MBA MSBA is a unique and innovative opportunity for those seeking to excel in both business administration and data analytics. The curriculum is designed to provide you with a comprehensive skill set that provides advanced business acumen with cutting edge data analysis expertise, ultimately preparing you for leadership roles in today's data driven business landscape. Our agenda today is to spend the next few minutes with you talking to, to you about the Cosweta Business School, the MBA MSBA program, and then hearing from one of our current MBA MSBNA students, Lynn Ye, who's going to talk to you about her background prior to the program as well as her experience so far. Um, so a little bit about the Cosweta Business School at Emory University. Our mission is to prepare principal leaders to have a positive impact on business and society. We are named for Roberto C. Cosueta, who was the former CEO of Coca-Cola and grew the company to the multi-billion growth that it is today. And one of our favorite quotes from uh, Mr. Cosueta is, not to take risk is the biggest risk of all. We are very passionate about our core values at the Gozueta Business School, and I will direct your attention to rigor. Um, rigor is something that we really incorporate into all our programs, and I think Lynn will be able to speak to this as well. Um, but we're also very passionate about courage, integrity, accountability, diversity, team, and community. So I hope you remember these core values as you do further research into our program and also hopefully apply to one of our many masters and MBA programs. Um, we are located in Atlanta, Georgia, uh, which is uh, the capital of the Southeast of the US. And we're really known for the number of Fortune 500 headquarters. We have Atlanta uh, with 16 and 75% of the Fortune 1000 companies having a presence in the area. So this is a really great city for you to start your career, um, not only in business, but of course, also in technology and data. Uh, we are considered to be the Silicon Valley of the South with um, over 70% of all global financial tr uh, transactions passing through Atlanta. We also are becoming a fairly big film uh, city with a number of films being uh, 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 filmed there and with many opportunities to get involved in arts and entertainment. So it's a great city to be in and Emory is located in the heart of Atlanta. So um, in addition to our MBA programs, we also offer a portfolio of specialized masters, which I would encourage you to explore, but we're specifically gonna talk about the MBA MSBA, which just started this May with three students. And what really sets Emory's MBA MSBA joint degree apart is its integration of the two complementary disciplines into a single cohesive curriculum. This integration allows you to develop a deep understanding of business concepts, strategic decision-making and leadership while also gaining proficiency in data analysis, statistics, machine learning, and data visualization. And this combination of skills is highly sought after um, by employers as it equips you to tackle complex business problems with data-driven insights and make informed strategic decisions. The program is STEM designated and will take you between 18 and 24 months to complete. And you will be able to complete a summer internship in between your first and second year. The MBA 
um, MSBA um, is really emphasizes uh, experiential learning. And we do this in every one of our programs at Emory, at Cozueta. Um, and this one is no different. So we are going to be offering you an opportunity to do an MSBA practicum where you will work for a company using their data to solve their problem. Um, as I mentioned before, you'll be able to do an internship in the summer between your two years. And you'll also have opportunities to participate in case competitions and other um, experiences where you'll work to solve problems for companies. So and this practical exposure not only enhances your learning experience, but also allows you to build a strong portfolio of accomplishments before or entering the workforce. Additionally, you will benefit from Gozueta's strong industry connections and partnerships with leading companies. This translates into networking opportunities, guest lectures, and recruitment events that will provide you with valuable exposure to um, uh, potential employers and industry uh, trends. The collaborative environment um, and small class size at Gozueta really enriches your experience. You will have the chance to engage with peers from diverse backgrounds um, from both the MBA program as well as the MSBA program. And this is really going to foster a dynamic learning environment where you can share insights and perspectives with those with very different backgrounds than yours. Our ideal candidate will be the candidate that is comfortable with data and coding, um, as we say, data savvy, but also business smart with at least two years of postgraduate work experience. Um, so now I would like to move to probably the most interesting part of our, our chat today, which is our conversation with um, Lynn, who just started the program in May. So Lynn, thank you so much for joining me today. Would you mind starting just by giving the audience a little bit of background about yourself prior to the program, and why did you decide to pursue the MBA, MSBA joint degree? Sure, thank you for having me today. And um, I'm a current MBA, MSBA dual degree student. My undergrad major is economics and I have almost five year working experience. My first job was working as an operating and planning specialist. The job includes creating new business organization structure and work process, designing expansion plans and collaborating with external partners to develop the new business. And my recent job was working as a sales analyst for almost three years. I analyzed transaction data and created data visualization projects to improve the sales performance and operational efficiency. So why did I choose to do the MBA and MSBA due degree program? I would say when I working as a sales analyst, I faced many problems that were hard or time consuming for me to solve. I realized I need more technical knowledge to improve my analytical skills, but I also need the structure system to know and to understand how to solve the complex business problem. So that's why I chose to do the MBA MSBA program that provides me with the opportunities to enhance my both technical and business acumen. Well, wonderful. Well, you started uh, the program in May with the one year MBA course. Yes. So tell us a little bit about that experience. I believe it was from May to mid July. Yeah. So for one year MBA, we, I have completed the core semester for the MBA. So in MBA, we have assigned it to the five to six members from the day one. The team is made up of the members from different backgrounds, different country and different major. And we learn and work on projects together. This is a really unique opportunity to stick with and learn from a group of talent individuals. And that us know more about what kind of team member I am and how to make the team better and successful. And for academics, we learn fundamental knowledge for almost every division in the business. 
So including accounting, finance, marketing, strategy, process management, and also leadership. And for the important part is the problem solving learning. The impact class not only teaches us the structure of defining the problem and constructing the recommendation, but also let us immerse ourselves in the problem from the real world clients. So it is a really unique and I would say interesting and we learn really much from this three months. So you, you start with the MBA students yes. and then in July, you mm -hmm. switched over to start with the MSBA cohort. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about that transition and mm -hmm. maybe some differences that you noticed between the two experiences. Yeah, so basically we have a little bit overlap in the July is we have only three classes in MBA and we have the bootcamp for MSBA. And the bootcamp includes we learning the skills such as programming language, R, SQL, Python, and mathematics and statistics to prepare as well for the future semester because it is really hard. So the transition is a little bit different because you will you will feel that MBA and MSBA course are really different. So for MBA, you more like to communicate and to know the fundamental knowledge, but in MSBA, you need to know really the technical thing. So you need to put more, I would say put more effort or you need to think more to understand the mathematic or statistic. And, but even though now I'm not fully sure the content will be in the future semester, but based on Professor Chalapa's words, I believe I will be a really different person after the MSBA experience. And I will have the ability to solve the problem, to solve the, that really complicated business problem analytically, and which is I don't have previously, yes. It's a little bit about your coding skills prior to the program. Had you coded before and were you comfortable with that going into the MSBA portion of the program? Uh, for my working experience, I only, I have only used the SQL in my working experience, but I have learned for R and Python for like a couple months. So now I will say that it is not easy for the person who don't know, who barely know anything about the data. But if you working hard, I would say you, you can figure it out. It is not that complicated, yes. Wonderful, so a little bit of coding prior to is helpful. Yes. Um, and just so everyone knows, the program then, Lynn will stay with the MSBA program um, for 10 months um, yes. through May. She will mm -hmm. then have the summer available for internship, and then she will return to the one-year MBA program and complete the final fall and spring semester. So she will be finished in 24 months. Um, my final question, Lynn, is just thinking about maybe some future uh, candidates that might be interested in this program. What would be a piece of advice that you would like to share with them? I would say do the research and note that whether you really love MSBA or not, because it is intense and you need the technical back, a little bit technical background, or at least you are really interested in this area. So do the research, and if you are really interested in this, you can reach out to me or to other two classmates, and we can we are really want to like share our experience with you. And I think it is a really good opportunities because you have the summer internship opportunities, and which is really great for no matter it's international student or domestic student. Yes. Thank you very much, and that's a great segue into our next step. 
Um, so we would love for you to complete an application. Um, if after your research, you decide this is a great program for you, um, you will start with an application to the MSBA program. And with that application, we will look at your resume transcripts, recommendation letters, essay, video essay, test scores, and then of course, an interview. Um, as I think we mentioned a few times, we do ask that if you pursue the MBA, MSBA, you have at least two years of post-undergraduate full-time work experience. And then, of course, prior coding skills um, are, are, are very helpful. Um, so um, our upcoming application deadlines for 2023 into 2024 are as follows. Um, and we really hope um, that you will explore this unique MBA, MSBA program more. And should you find yourself a fit, apply for our incoming cohort next May. Thank you very much for your time. And we look forward to getting you, to know you better. Should you have any questions about the program or about um, any one of the programs we discussed, you can reach out to msba at emory.edu. Thank you very much.